I forgot to change the color on that. I gotta fix that. Um, hi, I'm here. <laughs> Microsoft Group Therapy Night. <laughs> Microsoft Group Therapy Night. Sponsored by Windows. Not really sponsored by Windows, but that would be cool if it was sponsored by Windows. Um, sponsored by Surface after the erection you were holding today. Hey, hey, don't don't make it weird. Don't make it weird. Tell me I'm wrong. I. What did I say? I just said don't make it weird. Don't make it weird. Say I'm wrong. <clears throat> That's what I said. What I said. And that was a good show. All right. I was there was there was a lot of great stuff. I'm very happy with it, and it was fantastic. Um. I anyway. fixed a bug while we were doing that. Huh? I fixed a bug while we were doing that. You did work. Hmm. <laughs> wow. I mean, honestly, I'm yeah. I'm impressed. I I could. It wasn't the work I set out to do today, but it <laughs> it is the work that. That got done. It wasn't the work that they deserved, but it was the work that they needed right then. <laughs> All right, that's fair. Um, hi, it's Wednesday. Um, it's time for the second Jeez. show of the day because uh, group therapy night is happening right now, like post haste, immediately, all that fun stuff. Um, <clears throat> and uh, yeah, it has been a week, and I'm tired and. Good things have happened this week, but I'm very tired, so um, even more good things are about to come, and I'm going to be, by the time Saturday rolls around, like, I, I won't be bothered to get out of bed on Saturday. Like, I will just live there, and that's it. I'm done. Um, but anyway, let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's do this. All right, let's go. Leroy? Jenkins? Hmm. Let's see what we got here. Where's... There we go. Yeah, I think that works. Yeah, that's a nice undertone. Oh, so happy Wednesday, everyone. I hope your week is going well. Um, my week is going busy, but not bad. Good. I haven't been at work all week, so that's been nice. I've been doing other <laughs> stuff. Um, Bean can start to smell things again. So her sinuses are actually starting to clear up some. Like the swelling's going down and she's actually able to smell some things, but not everything. So that's fun. Um, we had the um, we had the surface event this morning. Um, so if you didn't catch that, it's up on the vods up right now. So you can watch that later. Um, and I gotta I gotta put that over on YouTube. I gotta I gotta go through my YouTube stuff. Like I've been exporting stuff there after every stream for months and I haven't put it like they're all still private. I need to like publicly list them. Someone's gonna like open YouTube tomorrow and get like thirty fucking video notifications that are just me putting up old shows. But I generate content. It's fine, it's fine. Um fine. it's fine. Everything's fine. We're all fine here. Um, so yeah. Uh, so yeah, I've been trying to help Bean out the last couple of days with her stuff. Um, cause that happened first thing Monday morning. Um, and we had Monday stream. We had two streams today. I've been getting stuff ready for Friday, which I'm just so, so excited about. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's been, it's been good. It's been a good, it's been a good week. Beans on the mend. Um, stuff is coming together. I think I have just about everything done for Friday night. Um, I gotta make sure that I'm all like squared away. But yeah, uh, I'm I'm pretty happy. So uh, I'm back at work tomorrow, which thankfully there shouldn't be too much for me to do this week anyway, because most everything's done. I know because I peaked. <laughs> um, and also, you know, 
I got a man on the inside. Um, you have someone on the inside. Who's that? Mm, it's this this fucking guy. You know, it's just just. just, just Everybody has guy. a face. Oh my god, he has such a face. You wouldn't believe the face. Is it, it's got a, a bibbity bobbity face. Oh god, it's just like so much of a face. Like it's ridiculous how much of a face. Just like so much of a face. Um. So yeah. Uh, work should be relatively quiet for the next couple of days. So I'm looking forward to that. And, oh, by the way, fair warning. I'm pairing with you on stuff the next couple of days. So. Yeah, I'm just. I have. It- I have taken specific work to accommodate the skull. I I know you have, and that's that's one of the many things that I appreciate about you. Uh, so yeah, I'm uh, I'm very much looking forward to the rest of the week, and by again by this weekend I will be just I'll be done. Um. Ah. <sighs> How about you? How's your week been so far? Oh, well, it's it's been a week. Um I completed all of my Shadowbringers relics in the critically acclaimed MMORPG Final Fantasy 14. Yeah, you did. So, I've got that going for me, which is nice. Which is nice. It's very nice. You should be very proud of yourself. So good. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, it's been uh it's been kind of a quiet week for you too, hadn't it? I brought the switch back upstairs. Nice. Switch is all hooked into everything. Um Uh I don't know if you were here for that conversation about the audio. Did I tell you about the, the capture card? You did. You were you were freaking out, happy about it when I was still here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I I got everything kind of uh, squared away and figured out. So I'm very happy about that. My uh, I'm gonna do something about this. Keeps like. Yeah. Um. Yes. I'm very very happy about that. So that's that's gonna be good. Um. Oh. I don't have, there we go. That's good too. Okay. Uh, so yeah, yeah. Uh, that's a, you've been, uh, you've been training for Friday night. No fights. No, no bean has holy shit. Bean's been going ham. She's been doing all the, uh, the time trials against like the Nintendo employees, the stuff that's built into the game. I think she's beaten all of them at this point. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. So she's uh Ooh. She's she's ready to uh kick some names and take some ass on Friday. And she's all out of names. And she's all out of names. <clears throat> uh speaking of names, we got we got fucking like there's gonna be ten of us on Friday. Like I'm just I'm beyond excited. That does remind me that I need to go over and make sure like everything is ready to accommodate for that. But I think it's gonna be a very, very good time. I'm looking forward to it. Holy shit. Oh be good. Yep. Like if this goes I'm well, gonna be there to bring up the rear. Yeah. <laughs> That means butt. <laughs> um, yeah, I, uh, I think um, if this goes well, we might make this like a regular thing, like maybe like once every couple of months or something, or once a quarter, have like a quarterly Mario Kart night. Yeah, it might not be a bad idea. <clears throat> that many people too frequently might not be realistic, but yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's for sure. Um, I also I want to start thinking about what I want to do for um, uh, the one year because one year's coming up pretty soon. One year is like two months from today. In fact, let me double check. So let's go back. 
Let me look at my stats, 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 stats. It's two months from tomorrow. So November the 23rd was my first day. Um, so my brother's birthday, November 23rd. Mm -hmm. Neat. I think that's also when Endwalker releases. Is it? Let's see. I should give my brother Endwalker. He doesn't mm -hmm. play video games that much. So I know that would, that would make it hilarious. Get him like Endwalker and just be like, ah, oh, just kidding. Here's a regular gift on sale. November 23rd, 2021. Yep. That's it. <laughs> I'll give it to him, and I'll be like, for your birthday, I give you a critically acclaimed MMORPG from Square Enix. That's fair. And I'll be like, I've got a kid. I don't have time for this. Mm -mm -mm -mm. If I pre-order it, like, I'm not going to be able to play it for, like, three years from now, roughly. Um... But if I pre-order it, I could get that fancy earring. That earring is a big deal. Yeah. Boy, howdy. Let me tell you. 30% uh, like experience bonus is nothing to sneeze at. It is not. You can get that. And kind of more important than that, in my opinion, that section of your armory chest is going to be clean. Yeah very clean yeah that's true that's very true hmm yeah i might do that i might i might just do that here before too long because i mean again i still got two months if i pre-order it in the next like month or so what is it 40 bucks mm -hmm. yeah and get that and that those earrings, you'll keep those earrings long after the game's been. Because realistically, after a while, you're probably only going to be having a handful of classes. Like you're still going to be leveling a bunch of classes for a long time. That's true. That's very true. Yeah. Yeah, I may end up doing that. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Um. It's funny earlier beans like she's like I'm so worried she's like like everything like up here hurts. I'm like well you're healing from having your face broken so I'm sure your body's freaking out a little bit. Then we get downstairs later and then she looks at me she's like playing Mario Kart and she's looks up at me she goes I'm an idiot. I'm like oh she's like I've been playing Mario Kart for two straight days. I'm like oh yeah that'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, that'll do it. Uh, yep. Bowser, buddy. Is Bowser is be, is he being Bowsery? He's being Bowsery. He went out not even an hour ago, but he's being Bowsery. I think I'm gonna try and take him out. You go outside, bud. Come on. Let's see how terrible my headset sounds this far away. Ooh, okay. Mm. This is a test of the remote headset system. This is only. Oh, a hello, test. Elliot. <gasps> it's the very good boy who loves cheese. I love the very good boy who loves cheese. He today he he became the very good boy that loves milk. Uh, milk is just pre-cheese. I know. So, I mean, yeah, he knows what he's about. He's a he's a very very good boy. Let's see if my uh if the noise canceling will pick up him freaking out when I pick him up. Oh, I heard <laughs> that. I heard that. He's unhappy with me. No, he's right, not bud. happy with you. Get back on your tower. I cleaned that thing like two weeks ago, and it's already turning white again. <laughs> what from his from his fur? From <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, poor buddy. Hi. It's purring. Oh. That's his secret, Captain. He's always purring. Mm-hmm. 
He's a very good boy. So are you guys getting a cat now that now that Bean Bean is at the ready? So we talked about that some today. Um so she's 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 very excited about the prospect of getting a cat, but she does want to wait until she makes sure that all of her stuff is good. Um so we may wait until the first of the year before we start looking. Um we also are thinking about instead of getting like something small, getting something more like middle-aged rescue. Um, Cause especially around here being in Florida, we have a lot of retirees and I'm sure that it happens all the time where you have an older person or, or an older couple who can no longer take care of an animal and they need to give that animal up for adoption. So that's kind of the thinking that we're having right now. So as long as, long as the, uh, and I, I have a little bit of experience with that, uh -huh. but it isn't a good experience because uh, we ended up with a cat and we were that cat's like fourth owner. So that, that guy went through some trauma and he ended up like ruining a couch. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And it's it wasn't it wasn't a good time. His name was Larry. Larry. Oh, Larry, the cat. Larry, the cat. Um. Ages ago, I dated someone who had a cat, and this cat was like my best friend, uh, and his name was Henry. We called him Henners. He was a very good boy. He was he was very fuzzy. He was like a gray with white accent, long hair. Um, just such a soft, fuzzy boy, and he had he had the best purr purrs, and he would love to give me kisses and. Um, in the mornings, what he would do is he would come into the room, into the bedroom in the morning and we, he would get up on the bed and I, I could wake up to him purring next to my face and he'd get up and do his purr thing. And then he would take his paw and just like pet my face really gently to try to wake me up. It was very sweet. And then as soon as I well, woke Liara up, does now. Liara does that to you. Yeah. When she wants food in the morning. Oh, he just wakes me up just because he wants to hang out with me. Like he woke me up and then he would like pet my face and then he would give like as soon as he noticed that I was awake, he would give me all of the kitty kisses. He would clean my beard for me. He's a very good boy. In fairness, my beard almost always smells like sandwiches. Larry Larry had problems and that should have been evident from the first time we took him to the vet and like we got his vet records. Mm-hmm. And part of his history was that uh, his original owners thought he was a female for a little bit. Oh. So he was also declawed. There was just a lot of the baby had a lot of problems, but yeah. he ended up um, my my cousins who live in Pennsylvania ended up taking him because we just we couldn't do it. Yeah, that's understandable. It sucks, but it's understandable. And then we got Bowser. And then you got Bowser, who is also a very good boy. He does his best. He does. He does. Listen. He's been, it, a, he's been a needy boy lately, though. I feel like he's uh, shown his age a little bit with how much he's been wanting to go outside. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm, maybe. Yeah. Maybe he's just maybe he's just like the rest of us and he's stuck of sick of being at the house and he's restless. He he goes out there and he. He does go to the bathroom, but then he also eats the grass and I'm. Since we recently took him to the vet because he was having stomach problems, we uh, I'm trying to get him not to do that. Yeah. That's 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 understandable. Yeah. I get that. Well. Oh. Man, I'm just worn out. Mm. And like I had all this energy this morning during the the surface thing. And then like you know, just whoa. Well, I mean Pretty sure we have a clip of oh Lord you uh, of the moment that you lost all of your energy. 
Yeah, no, yeah, we do. We do. There it is. There it is. Yep. That's that's where I lost my goddamn mind. Let's see if I can Let's see if I can get this to Yeah, uh, oh my god, yeah. They're using the song again. Zunder is having an out of body experience, I can see it. I did, I really did. <laughs> he's out of line, but he's right. Someone quick, take a screenshot. Krako is always out of line, but he's almost always right, too. Real. In my defense, when they used that song before, like, blew my mind. I think he's broken and he just came. No, I... All at the same time. Did we did we give Allie a lewd for that one earlier? I don't know if we gave her a lewd for that. Um, I think you're the one that needs a lewd for that one, bud. I didn't do anything. She said it. I was just standing there. I was in shock. I was in shock. All right. Still think you're the one that needs the lewd for that one. How do I get the lewd for that one? I wasn't lewd. You were just in that much shock. I was. I really was. Uh, that was good this morning, though. I really enjoyed that. I really, really enjoyed that. Um, that was, yeah. Yeah. Good times. It was good times. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm just... Oh, boy, I'm wiped out after today. I don't usually do two streams in one day. I think the last time I did that was the E3 thing, and when was that? July, I think? Was that two streams in one day, or was that just an off stream? I think it was two, because I did the E3 thing, and it was a. am pretty sure that was a Sunday. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. It's that's that was like that was, that was that more was than days a sprint ago. ago. Yeah. Who knows? It was more than more than a sprint ago. I don't I don't know anymore. Oh, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, man. <gasps> Hi, Scarlet. We, I was just thinking about you because Lollipop uh, reminded us all about that clip from earlier today that you caught with my mouth hanging to the ground, looking like a, like some kind of just wild person. Like I'm, oh, like a, I was gonna say like I live in the woods, but I'm a bear. So that kind of tracks for me. That's fair. Hey, remember remember when Scarlet was like freaked out because Allie sounds just like her? <laughs> like it's kind of amazing. I'm like it's pretty fantastic, I gotta tell you. Let's see, I gotta see if I can find Do, do, do. Let's see. What is this? What was she playing? Oh, she's playing Guild Wars. I want to find. I'm. I'm finding an old Scarlet clip so you can hear this because I don't know. You have you have you watched her channel before? I don't think I have. Okay. Well, first of all. If you're not following Scarlet, uh, do bot. What do you do? There it goes. Uh, if you're not, do it. Like, but like, why? And like, do it. Uh, second of all, um, I'm I'm gonna see if I can get this and see how this sounds.
Is it not? What's going on? It was oh. Involved. Okay, let's see if we can get this. Once you exhaust all that, you go back to Wells again. What is happening? That looks fun. Figure out a way to Oh yeah, there's rocks involved. Oh god, Guild Wars 2. Yeah. Oh yeah. She plays her fair share of it. Give me I haven't rock. touched Guild Wars 2 in like ages. Okay, right, let's find let's let's try it. Let's try a different one. Let's try this one. That's kind of like my main goal for today, but in the long run. Oh god. <laughs> oh god, that scared me so bad. <laughs> okay, though. <laughs> That's 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 pretty good. I gotta tell you, that's pretty fucking good. But also, like, I've never okay. So, please, please explain Guild Wars like I'm five. Um. So, trying to equate it to what you know and. Scarlet will probably end up being able to actually tell you more about it because I played it when it first came out for like three, four months, and then I didn't touch it after that. And um, it was buy to play back then, as in there was no subscription for it. Okay. And I th think it's free to play now, but um. The combat is sort of similar to like what you're dealing with in 14, except like smaller nuances. There's a lot less buttons to push. The abilities aren't as um, hard set. They're based like you pick a class and then um, you can that class can equip certain weapons and then the abilities that you have are based on that weapon and then you can have some other stuff on the side and then like it so it, it's it's a lot a little bit more fluid in that regard um but then like while there is a story there's not like a lot of quests it's more like you fill in the map fill up a gauge as you're going around um you do different you just do different things on your map to level and then um it's just a lot of jumping puzzles so many jumping puzzles and like <laughs> it's yeah it, it's it, it, it was all right i i forget the name of the class that i played um mesmer i played mesmer okay for, at the beginning of it and they their whole shtick was making copies of themselves in some way, shape, or form. Like you just... It's really what they did. Oh. All right. And it, it was fun, but, like, after a while, I was just like, all right, I'm going to go back to World of Warcraft. Yes, yes, I did. It was obnoxious, and I had a good time with it, and then I got bored really quickly, so I went back to playing World of Warcraft. And now I'm a 14 shill. See, see, we all have, we have, a, we all have our things we shill around here. I shill all things Microsoft. You shill for critically acclaimed MMORPGs by Square Enix, as one does. One, one of them. I don't. I've never played Eleven, so I can't shill for it. Was it critically acclaimed? I have no clue. Well, see, there you go. Obviously, not not enough. <laughs> not enough for it to you know for you not to really notice. Well, obviously. I mean, listen, I'm just I'm just saying. Actually. Well, actually. Ah, uh, you you shill for the very good boy who loves cheese and milk. Oh. 
man, I just can't get it together tonight. I don't know. Like, I, I got up here and, like, stream started. And then, like, I just, just, <laughs> like, everything just hit me, like, Kaboomy. We just seem to like his pictures. That's, that is the most understated way you could have put that. I would murder for the, the, the good, the very good boy who loves cheese. He's a very good boy. He's doing his best. And he loves cheese. And he loves cheese. Also, what is she, what is she doing? Tonight? What are you doing tonight? What is she doing? Uh, I think she's just taking it easy tonight. I don't know what she's doing, but I am, uh, right now jumping around a random city in Breath of the Waifu. Is she in, is she at her computer? She is. She's watching the stream. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing over there? I'm looking over at her. Cause she's from where, from where, from where Lollipop sits. Elena is actually physically over there. True. And then, typically, Zundefron is behind him. It's true. So he's got Zundefron behind him. He's got Elena over to his right, my left, because, you know, I'm facing. Alternating between Ley Lines and Breath of the Waifu, and possibly Gophering on Limitless. Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. Limit yep. your less. Wow, less your limit? Does that work? Oh, I gotta turn I forgot to turn the air conditioning down. Get warm in here. I gotta turn that down. No, 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 didn't mean to hit that button. No one wants to see the no one wants to see the I don't want the camera to turn on on my phone. Gotta turn the Turn the air down because it's getting warm in here already. I've been up here all day though. Like, I went and got breakfast this morning, came up here at like 9 45 ish, and then, because then you got on voice like right after stand up was over, which seemed like it didn't go very long today. Um, no. And then. We had the show at 10.30. I got off at 12 to go have some lunch. Came back up after lunch. Was working on stuff. We are hanging out. Oh, God. I can't wait to show you all, all the shit for Friday. Oh. Oh, there's so much good stuff. And Lollipop has seen like 40% of it. <laughs> it's so much good stuff. Like, so much. I cannot wait. Cannot wait. Oh. So excited, y'all. Like, I'm just... Like, Mario Kart is just, like, half of what I'm excited about on Friday, and I'm so pumped up about it. Um. Oh, I can't wait. Ah. <laughs> hmm. I need, um, oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot my donut. <gasps> You're going to your donut. mom's for the weekend for fun stuff just to hang out. You had just a bit too much wine. Listen, listen, just as long as you don't do anything like stupid. I mean, I do st stupid things sober all the time. Oh, y'all are getting Frida's this weekend? Niece's birthday party, that should be fun. Hey, I'm gonna have a niece soon. In like, like, you know, three weeks or so. You gonna, uh, you gonna go to her birthday party? Well, I mean, I'm probably gonna be attending her birth, like, post-birth. Like, I'll, I'll probably be there, like, right afterwards. <laughs> yeah. her, her, her actual birthday, yes. <laughs> yes, probably her actual the, birthday. Uh, yeah. Are you gonna be the guy on uh, out in the on the tarmac with the little lights waving them out? Just yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> All right, kid, this way. Let's go. This way and into the bassinet. <laughs> this way, <laughs> into the bassinet. Let's go. We're directing traffic here. Um, and then and then down to the maternity ward. <gasps> Vivian. Vivian. Vivian, I, I cannot I cannot properly express how much I love you. That is all. Scarlet may have had too much wine. I have had no wine or other alcohol or spirits or whatnot. So I am just, you know, I am just running on, running on like a, a quarter tank right now. Um, ah, yeah, it's been, uh, yeah, it's been a, it's been a really good day today. Um, I'm, I'm so happy about the way things have gone this week. Like, I am a little disappointed because I haven't worked on any of my voiceover stuff this week. But in my defense, everything else has been going on this week between like Bean stuff and we were at her mom's over, excuse me, over the weekend. And then, um, yeah. Yeah, just like normal stuff. So. <laughs> Also, in your defense, you have something going on with Cracko. <laughs> yeah, I know what it is. I actually haven't worked on that. I need to, but I haven't. I know where Cracko lives, though. I found that out by somewhat necessity today. We had oh, the, really? He and I had that discussion today, yeah. Yeah. You gonna dox him now? Oh yeah, for sure. I'm just gonna like, mm. I'm gonna order ridiculous quantities of like frog stuff and send it to his house. Mm, and bags of dicks. No, just frog stuff. Just frog stuff. Mm. So it's not like so it's not like lewd. It's just odd. So like when his family sits there and is like, "Who keeps sending you all of this weird frog stuff?" He'll just have to be like, D "Don't worry about it." I'll tell you when you're older. Yeah, <laughs> right. Pretty much. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's about it. By the way, if anyone would like to join us in voice, please feel free. Uh, you can join us, join the Discord, and when you do, you can jump into the stream chat lobby, and I can pull you in if you would like to talk. Just tell us about how your day slash week slash month slash millennium is going. You know, we're a couple of years into it. Hey, look at that. Hey. I know you. Hey, I know you too. Right? Hi, Hidden. Hi. There's a Hidden in the chat. <laughs> there's a there's a Scarlet next to me. This is great. Okay, so... <laughs> okay, so now, Lollipop, you get to hear this firsthand. Like, you get to hear, like, live Scarlet to know. Yeah. Like, yeah... <laughs> Like already, already, isn't it uncanny? <laughs> yeah. Like, the first time I heard Ali, I was like, "What? Wait, when did they get my voice recording?" Yeah, it's true. <laughs> it's true. Like it's kind of wild. Um. <laughs> <laughs> you even do the thing like she does. That's that's just great. <laughs> oh God. Oh God. <laughs> and then Ali's gonna come in here later. There's gonna be two of them. Hidden, come on, like hidden hidden's known Allie longer than I have. Hidden, isn't this just like isn't this just wacky? Like it's it's kinda wild, isn't it? Oh my god. Uh well, other than, you know, enjoying a little uh Yeah, you took it had a double take, yeah, right, right? So other than having a little too much wine, uh how's your week been, friendo? You doing all right? has been going pretty good uh i'm just spending some time geode hunting on wild right now Ooh, geodes ah, it is not going very well because well i uh forgot to bring torches last time and i had to fight for an extra 20 minutes to make sure i didn't get jumped on by creepers and stuff um that's all right <laughs> you know mo almost got blown up a couple of nights ago so <laughs> what's the difference <laughs> I, guess I mean, fine. when doesn't Mo almost get blown up, though? That's a good point, yeah. Actually, she would have gotten blown up had she not had her uh, her totem with her. Because I, um, like, I saw that clip, and I saw the totem pop up on screen, and I'm like, 
that girl almost died again. I mean, she's the best at it, but, you know, it's what she do. (laughs) Yeah. Oh. You don't think it'd be like that, but sometimes it do. Sometimes it do. It really do be like that. Yeah. I really wish we could get Luna and Mr. Cupcake on here sometime. Like, I know it's really, like, hella late for them, but, man, I would love for them to be able to come hang out with us one night, because... I God, like Luna is just the best. She really is. Luna is fantastic. Here, actually, while I'm thinking about it, do do do. Um. So, did I? Oh no, I did. Oh, I hit the S. I didn't mean to hit the S. Let me fix that. And we to break there it. You go. I know. I know. I know. I fat fingered <laughs> it. It's fine. All right. Anyway, follow follow Miss Luna. She's fantastic, um, and typically she likes to talk about food stuff too. Um, oh yes. Th- there's there's always some kind of delicious something, usually bread, being made in her house. Um, and yeah. I want bread. <laughs> oh God! Like it's it's like that Oprah moment. You just sit there and suddenly you're like, I love bread. And that's it. Like yeah. that's it. That's all you can think about is bread. Forever bread. You know those little <laughs> you know those little loaves of bread that they'll bring you at the the outback? Like those little like mm-hmm. dark like rye loaves or whatever? Or like I guess they're like I guess they're like a wheat bread, but they're so dark they look like a rye loaf. Yeah. Or like a pumpernickel. Oh, those things are so good. Oh, my favorite are the Texas Roadhouse rolls with the honey butter. Oh, the honey butter. I haven't been to Texas Roadhouse in ages. Um, just going in there, throwing fucking peanut shells on the floor like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> God, that's the good stuff. Um, we have a we have a chain down here called Cody's, which is fairly similar. Um, it's a little bit like dirtier, but we're in Florida, so you know, go mm-hmm. figure. Um, but they're a lot like that, where it's it's a steakhouse, and they give you the 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 thing of peanuts that you can take to your table and throw the shells on the floor and all that shit. And also like um they do the thing where they put like the the white craft paper on the table as the tablecloth so you can draw on it and shit. They give you like the little can of crayons. <laughs> Hell yeah. Heck yeah. Yeah. Tic tac toe champ right here, baby. Right here. <laughs> yeah. So Ooh, gotta get this whoops. <sighs> well I fell. Well, don't do that. It's kind of hard to not or well, it words. Yep. I can words. I swear. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <gasps> <laughs> okay. Found my staircase up. We're good. <laughs> yeah, yogurt. Uh, you, yeah, yogurt. Yogurt flavor. Yogurt covered. That's right. Hidden. Don't hate. You don't even listen. Like, you don't even like. You don't even like craisins. Chocolate or bus? Fine. Fine. I'll get the chocolate. Yum. Wait, did I finish the chocolate? Oh <gasps> no! And you didn't tell anybody? I okay. Not the chocolates. Hidden. <laughs> Hidden. <laughs> Out. I'm uh, oh, I'm that's so sad. I'm out of chocolate. I'm sorry. All right, I gotta. <sighs> Damn it! I should have gotten those today. All right, let me go update the bot. Let me make sure it knows. Raspberry lemonade. All right, raspberry lemonade. It is. Okay. Makes me want uh, chocolate covered espresso beans. Oh, Although I really God, should I have love those. those. <laughs> oh. Do they? They're my favorites. Do they? Do they make you do the bouncy bounces? Oh, the bouncy bounces. Yeah, you're all. Listen, you're already running at full steam anyway. I don't think you need the extra. Like just. Phew. No, I definitely don't. Especially when I have to go to bed in a, like an hour or two for work. Gross waterless berry. Listen, listen here, hidden. Don't you? Don't you start no shit with me? All right. Yeah, goober or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Get get wrecked. I told you. 
get fucking told. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to go update the flavors now. Holy shit. You're a flavor. I am, in fact, a flavor. Your flavor is bear. My flavor is bear. That's that's also true. All right, let's see what we got out of stock now. Um. Um. Uh oh, where's my shulkers? Oh, I ate them. I I would hope not. I need those. That has all my calcite in it. Mm. Yeah, because I'm the Delicious idiot who wants calcite. Delicious. Yeah. Okay. If you say so. But I'm the idiot who wants to do a uh, giant marble uh, freaking wool farm on Wild. I mean, listen, you got to do what you got to do. All right, there we go. Uh, Fritz, thank you for that, host buddy. Whipped cream cheese and juice. Listen, like, you know, as long as G doesn't fucking eat it all. Ooh, whipped cream cheese reminds me of something I like to do. Um, Whipped cream cheese um, on a pickle wrapped in cheese and ham. Cream pickle, cheese on a pickle but... wrapped in... Wait, okay, say that again. <laughs> Rip, whip, blah, 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 blah. Whipped cream cheese mm -hmm. on a dill pickle mm -hmm. that's wrapped in provolone and deli ham. Oh. Wrap the whole thing in a tortilla then. Ooh, yeah, yeah, that'd be see? good. Because then that way you don't have to worry about getting stuff on your hands. It's basically like, like hidden. You don't fucking like just you don't like anything hidden. Hidden's like, wow, I don't like this. I don't like raisins. I don't like yogurt. I don't like pickles. I don't like <laughs> hidden's like I don't like fun. I like it. <laughs> I only like whipped cream cheese and juice. Juice. Hi, Andrea. Fritz, I think I think bears would be flavored. I think I would be flavored. I would be far more beef flavored than I would be chicken flavor. I would think. Okay. Um, I don't like anything hidden, probably. I mean... <laughs> oh, the Twitch, no the Twitch notifications? Yeah, Twitch has been... Like, the last two weeks, Twitch notifications have been... Actually, Twitch everything Cats. has been really been weird. I don't know what the fuck's been going on, but it's been it's been hella twitchy the last couple of weeks. Like notifications have been off, streams have been having issues. I don't know what the fuck there is going on lately, but yeah, it's been weird. Oh, what the fuck? You're live on my end. Mm hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I'm live now. Oh, then you bounce out and come back and it's fine. Mm. Hmm. Oh, then you forget. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Whoops. Oh. Yeah. So, done did a derp. Yeah. I do those a lot. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Oh. Well, at least like at least I haven't even been live for an hour yet, so you know, that's good. I mean, honestly though, like yeah. It's been it's been such a busy week. Everybody's had a week this week. Like I was I was talking to the folks over in Tabs chat this morning after we got done. And, like, everybody seems to be, like, just this week has been oof. I blame the full moon. Probably. Oh, by the way, speaking of seasons and stuff, happy fall. You know, for those of you who live in a place with seasons. An actual fall. <laughs> yeah. Unlike us who live in Florida. <laughs> where uh, I think... Our high was, or our, at 9.30 in the morning, it was 79 degrees, or 72, or something like that. Let's see, what's our, what's our weather like tomorrow? Um, it's not going to get below 74. Oh. For, until at least October the 1st. Ooh, um, you can keep it. 
Yeah, yeah, thanks. Thanks. Yeah, actually, I I do want dark at 4 p.m. I do want dark at 4 p.m. Thank you very yeah. much. I do, too. Welcome. Yeah, see, y'all over there in the other sunshine state, you feel our pain, Amy. You feel it. You understand what's going on. Eh, 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 eh. Mm. You tell me what I I want. I know, understand. (laughs) Don't you tell me what I want. You're like fourth down on the list of people who know what I want, but you don't, don't you tell me what I want. Andrea and I have been friends for like 58 Ever? years. Yeah, something like that. I also love the darkness. Yeah, you see, you do get faultless. And I love... Do you want ants? Because this is how you get ants. Viv, you know those references now. <laughs> fourth. Well, it is like fourth. It's like Bean, Tom's in there somewhere. Oh, Savannah. Savannah probably knows. And then you. Yeah, that seems to be about the natural order. I believe in a thing called love. You believe in a thing called love? I believe. I believe. (laughs) I would play it, but you know, I don't want to get DMCA'd. That song is almost 20 years old. Almost. Released in 2003, this says. September of 2003, so right at 18 years now. Dan! Dan, buddy! Buddy, I miss your fucking face, guy. How are you? Oh. Like, I miss you so much. How have you been? I love you. What's been going on with you? Fish sticks. Fucking love fish, fish sticks. sticks. God damn it, no. I love fish sticks. I haven't had fish sticks in so long. Chicken wing, chicken wing, hot dog and bologna. Dog and bologna chicken and macaroni, chilling with my homie. She even sings that like Ellie does. I see, see. It's like it's it's. Yeah, it's really weird. Started a new job. Awesome. Is it? Is that like a, a good change? It is almost like Allie's here. Like honestly, the o- like the only thing that's missing now is her like telling the dogs to calm down. <laughs> She's like Jackson, Jackson, what are you doing? Panna, no, you can't have this. Oh, uh, I wonder what she's doing. She's probably she's probably still probably napping. Hanging. Oh, no, I don't think she's napping. I think she's still hanging out with Vander because they were playing No Man's Sky earlier. Hmm. It seemed very tired today, though. New job, shiny, more pay. Hey, man, fuck yeah, dude. Congrats, man. That's awesome. I'm very happy for you. Congratulations. I'm very, very happy for you. I The last concert that I saw, Fritz, I went to see The Killers. Um in two in 2019 um so just about two years ago now um they came here um for one of the radio stations has a big thing here every year called next big thing and so they came to tampa and uh the killers are bean's absolute favorite band on the planet um so she got to see them when they came to tampa like 10 years prior um and so i got her for her for birthday slash Christmas that year, um, I got us like like ultimate VIP seats. So like we were sitting right behind the soundboards at like this nice little area where we had our own little private table and everything. Um, 
And then later we got to go on stage. Um, like we kind of, we got a backstage tour, um, during the show. Uh, so that was really cool. So that's the last show I've been to now. Man, that was good. Oh, so good. Who all was there? Uh, I hear the killers were there. Yeah, yes, they 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 were. In fact, they were. That's a that is a thing that that happened. Let's see. Um, they had some rigorous capture there. While they were there, they were like all the time asking if they were human or if they were dancer. I I I I I could not I could not answer. Uh, Paris was there and Switchfoot was there. That's right. I saw Switchfoot for the first time. That was the first time I even listened to Switchfoot in like fucking that's, fifteen that is, years. Say that is a name I haven't heard in a long time. Right. That's like one of those. I haven't heard that name I'm gonna, since. I'm gonna have to ask you to refrain from bringing them up again. My back just started feeling better. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Back when I was, uh, back when I was still a religious fellow, or you know, live with my parents. Take your pick. Religious filler. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But like, I tell you what, though, they uh. What? They started playing Meant to Live, and I'm like, mm, yeah, I know that song. I know that one. I've been there. They did Dare You to Move. They did a couple others. Oh, yep. I... So, yeah, that's been a while. Oh. Yeah. Oh, let me up. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind Scarlet. She's just trying not to die in on the wild server. Yeah. Yeah. We got torches again. Oh come on, Scarlet, buddy! You got to bring torches with you. That's how you keep you know the bad stuff from showing up. I know. You know that's that's how you that's how you don't have run into the uhs and the clickety clacks and the pss, pss, and all that stuff. I mean, those are your three basic Ooh. groups. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I think we talked about that at one point, Dan. I think I remember you telling me about that. <laughs> A full stack of wood and blocks of coal. That's actually, yeah, yeah. That's a good point. It is, it is higher density to keep that on you than it is to keep torches. Ah. The problem is, I, I, I technically have it. It's just in my ender chest, which I left here. Oh. Mm. Like a dinghy. Yeah, you know. I, I do that a lot. Mm. Oh, my God. Um, Netflix has announced the acquisition of the Roald Dahl Story Company. Giving it the rights to create projects based on the author's work across all mainstream entertainment media. That means Netflix. Uh, that means Netflix now owns um, both Matilda and Willy Wonka. Oh. Yeah. Twenty twenty one. I'm not sure how I feel about mm, that yeah. one. I'm. I'm. I don't know, man. Listen, I got my 40th anniversary of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory downstairs. Like, got to tell you, like, the production value was good, but just not impressed by the the Johnny Depp version. Like, I, yeah. maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just an old fuddy-duddy, but, like, nobody, nobody will be Willy Wonka except for Gene Wilder. Yeah, I, I totally agree on that one. Maybe the prequel, like, showing him growing up with his parents and how, like, terrible they were. I mean, maybe... But yeah, Elena's cat toys. Oh my god, Elena's cat toys. That's it's it's lo lollipop. It's because your wife is a cat. You see, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she is. She's cat. Hey, look, so 
It's my Let's Go Pikachu. I have one of those. It's for the Nintendo Switch Entertainment System. Meow. Gene, Gene Wilder was the best. He really, really was. Bless him. Uh, I would love to see the Foo Fighters, though. That would be a damn good show. Would love to see the Foo Fighters. Like, Dave Grohl just seems like the absolute coolest fucking guy to hang out with, you know? Like, you just, you just want to hang out with him and, like, rub his hair and be like, you know what, you're an all right dude. Oh, Young Frankenstein, Blazing Saddles. Yep. Yep. I actually have the, uh, I've got the Mel Brooks collection on Blu-ray downstairs. So it's got, like, Young Frankenstein, Frankenstein, Blazing Saddles, Spaceballs, The Producers. Um, let me see. Spaceballs. Let me see, because I think I got it from... Yeah, the Mel Brooks collection has... Blazing Saddles, Spaceballs, Young Frankenstein, uh, High Anxiety, History of the World Part 1, Robin Hood, Men and Tights, Silent Movie, To Be or Not To Be, and The Twelve Chairs. So it's like... Phew. Only one person would dare to give me the raspberry. <laughs> Hail Scroob. Ah, uh, yeah. And some somebody the other day asked Mo if she had ever seen Spaceballs. I'm like, Mo has seen Spaceballs. It is it is one of her favorite movies. It is top tier for her. Spaceballs the MoCraft. Spaceballs the MoCraft. Ah. Uh, also, justice for Bubba. God, I, I love all of Mo's cats. They're just, she has the best cats. He really does. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just, uh, I'm just happy me, me posting one meme in that chat is going to, I feel like it's sparking a thing. I feel like things oh, yeah. are going to, in, in the works. It's true. It's true. This, this is, this is, this is, Bubba is the cat that launched a thousand memes. Hidden, I love you, friendo. I hope you, your tummy feels okay and you get all the good sleepy sleeps. Go get some rest. We'll see you on Friday. John Candy is barf. I know. I'm a mog, half man, half dog. I'm my own best friend. Just like. God, John Candy, I miss him too. Oh, that reminds me. Uh, I gotta see if it's on there. I think it is. Um, but. On Disney Plus. <laughs> I think Cool Runnings is on here. Dang it, now I have the Chicken Wing song in my head. Thanks You're a welcome. lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just one of the many services I provide. It's true. It's true. Like, like Earworms is just like, that's one of his absolute best things that he does. Well, I say best. He's, it's one of the things that he is most efficient at. Let's put it that way. Aren't you, bud? Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look at the bright side. It hasn't been uh, Rock Lobster for a while. Oh, yeah. You haven't done Rock Lobster in months. That's weird. Yeah. But yeah, Cool Runnings is on there. Um, Bean has never seen Cool Runnings. So at some point, um, I have to, to show her Cool Runnings. Just great, great movie. Fantastic. Um, feel the rhythm. Feel the rhyme. Get on up. It's bobsled time. What's funny is my old boss is Jamaican, 
and we every once in a while <laughs> we would get him to say it. Like he would try to do it, and he'd never seen it. So he like he just knew of it anecdotally. <laughs> so yeah, he would do it, and I'm like, no, no, I'm like ready. Repeat after me. I'm like, I'm gonna teach you how to be movie Jamaican. It's fine. You got real Jamaican down. Now I gotta teach you how to how to do it for the movies. It'll be fine. You get over it. We'll we'll do great. We'll do great. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. Listen, Andrea. Andrea. Andrea's like. She's like, sometimes Zach and friends slip into video game talk on stream, and suddenly I'm wondering when people started worrying about the weight of wood so intensely. It's not the weight of the wood. It's the it's how much you can carry. So you have a limited amount of s th things that you can carry on you at any given point in Minecraft. So when you go out to do, when you set out for a task, you got to plan for that pretty well. And think about it. Bean thinks I look True. like an idiot when I do this. I don't care. She's probably fucking right. Ah. <laughs> Where was my way up? Over here. Eh. No, come back. Chicken wing, chicken wing, hot dog and maloney, chicken macaroni. <laughs> and my, my job homie. here is done. <laughs> <laughs> but you didn't do anything. Whoosh. <laughs> uh, ha, 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 ha. Did I? Yeah, no, you did. You did. Hmm. Okay, my mind is a, a constant music box, so every little thing will just catch. Uh, oh my god it's the uh it's the uh that's the neat part you don't meme and like the kid's got like playtime six hours over his face it says when do i start getting good and home skillet has playtime 5001.7 hours You're like that's the neat part you don't <laughs> <laughs> uh I can't recommend Invincible enough if for no other reason than the memes. Than the memes. Than the memes. Yep. Yeah. The, I mean, it looks like a neat show, and it's on. Uh, it's on Prime, right? Yep. It is gory as thin, though. Just as a like they they try to hide that fact in the first episode. I. I cannot in good conscience, if you do not like gore, I cannot hide that from someone. Yeah. Yeah. Not, I mean, not to the degree that. that they, it, well, not to the degree that they do it. Like, it's, it's bad. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, Andrea, give it time. Listen. You have enough technology people that follow you that eventually someone will come in. Well, actually, give it time. Mm -hmm. Like, give it about uh, 10 more minutes. We'll get there. Don't worry. Listen, so here's, here's kind of my thing. For It's like, it's group therapy night, but it doesn't like, one, in a traditional group therapy setting, you have like, a professional typically who moderates and you know whatever what's the name of the show again lollipop uh which one are we talking about the one you were just talking about oh invincible invincible that's the name of it i can never remember but that's yes invincible it's an it's an animated show very much for adults um so it's group therapy, and no, I am not the adultiest adult. Yes, you are. Shut up. Um, but like usually there is a professional who's, you know, moderating. Oh, you didn't know? Listen, 
the mere existence of the stream is derailing. So, you know, you're fine. <laughs> also, you get priority. I don't know who. I don't know. Um, Fritz can be the adultiest adult tonight. Fritz, Fritz, you're the adultiest adult here tonight. Congratulations. How does it feel being wrong? Shut your face. But anyway, I mean, like, this is really just like our time to chill out and just talk about whatever's on our mind. Like, a lot of times in group therapy, you know, we're bringing problems and stuff. And I mean, we do that here too, but I think this is just really our time to chill out and do whatever we want. Like, mm. yeah, see, f yeah, Fritz, old man Fritz says, get off, get off his lawn. <laughs> oh, did I tell you we bought a power washer? That's a very adulty thing to do. Mm. Wow. That's super adulty. It's true. We we knee jerk bought one on Amazon because I found a coupon code on TikTok and a hundred and fifty dollar power washer was eighty bucks. So uh Okay, that's a good we're deal. Giving, we're giving it a shot, yeah. He knee jerk bought one. Okay, so uh your your wife would like to correct you and say that you knee jerk bought it, she just facilitated it. I is okay. she wrong? I'll, I'll own that. I'll own that one. All I, right. I mean, if she, she's, I guess I will own that one. Yeah. She's out of line, but she's right. I don't even know how out of line she really is in this regard. I mean, that's a fair point. That's a fair point. <gasps> hey, I'm veteran reward rank two in uh in fourteen. Ooh, how'd you find out? I logged into Mog Station. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Fancy. It's because I bought uh, six months up front, though. You know, as as one does sometimes. Okay, like I just, you do. Like you do. Okay, look, just like. Ding, ding, bong. Look at my character, though. You've been rocking that outfit for a while now. I have been. I really have been. Like, oh. But it's a good look for me. Mostly it's my hair that I love. I do. I do love my hair. Oh, oh, I got cherry. Also, hi, Dommy. How are you, buddy? You doing all right? How's your th Thursday going? I had to, I couldn't remember what day it was here today to do the calculations for your end. No, it's Friday. Or no, uh, when? Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, it's Wednesday. Ignore me. No, it's fine. It's Wednesday for us. Dami, uh, he lives. He lives in the upside down with the koalas and the the uh, kangaroos and all. In the danger area, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where everything's trying to kill you. It's pretty good. Yes. It's actually pretty good. Like I'm, I'm wiped out because we had the stream this morning, um, doing the surface stuff. So it was so much fun. But yeah, Dom lives in the future with the nope spiders. Yeah, that's that's a really good way to put yeah. that. Actually, she's out of line, but she's right. <laughs> I don't even know how aligned she is. Yeah, that's a fair point. <laughs> mm. But yeah. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> mm. To, to Dom's point, um... That's why we have we why we pay someone to do the lawn right now because uh, paying someone else to do lawn care is cheaper than medical bills. That's yeah, that's true. Boy, free healthcare, man. That's 
What's that like? <laughs> Access to healthcare. What's that like? How's that work <laughs> exactly? Oh. oh, man. Tom just posted something in random, which I think is hilarious. Jesus comes from a shortening of the Hebrew version of the name Joshua, while Christ simply means the anointed one. To make this clearer to modern Christians, I propose a new Bible translation where Jesus is referred to only as Oily Josh. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh, uh, that's the most religion we'll get into tonight. <laughs> uh, fan fucking tastic, everyone. I'm a level fifty six summoner. Yeah, and your uh your world's gonna get turned on its head in two months. When the Enjoy yeah, when the the expansion Enjoy your comes dots out. your while you can. Oh yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, we have taxes too, Dom. We just spend them on weird shit. Like paying people to check that the tax records that we file every year are actually the tax numbers that they have on file even though they have the files already we pay our taxes we just uh don't get as many benefits as we would like um yeah dom it's well it's not that we have to think how much to pay it's that we have to tell them how much we're supposed to pay even though they have all the paperwork like, they have the paperwork, but we also have to tell them it's, um, yeah. Well, we have, we have sales tax, too, but. Yeah, like, sales tax, and we don't have VAT. We don't have, yeah, we don't have, like, VAT. We don't have value-added tax. So, you know, things like that we don't have. We do have sales tax. But like, we use it for things Some like have sales tax on certain things. We use it for things like patching the road, but not even you know, micro center <laughs> in quotes, patching the road. Oh God, don't get me started on the roads in PA. Oh, oh, oh no! I've I lived in Pittsburgh for two years. I oh you know I know. Oh yeah, dear yeah. God. Jonas still lives in Pittsburgh. Mm. Mm hmm. Yeah, we got we got a lot of like Pennsylvania and Pennsylvania adjacent folks. So yeah, yeah. Jonas lives. Actually, it's funny because you and you and Jonas, uh, yeah, you you have probably passed each other at some point up there. Mm. But uh. Oh, God, that is the worst first trip to ever have. You know, a I lot of stuff so about sorry. you just started making sense, Elena. A lot of stuff. I mean, mostly the driving thing. Um, But yeah, so... Yeah, I mentioned, I mentioned that you have probably passed Jonas at some point, Lollipop, because... Um, Jonas lives and has lived in Pittsburgh for a while now. And, uh, uh, he went to a fancy liberal arts college, not far from Cleveland. You know, any famous ones up that way? Mm. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I have an ex-girlfriend that went there. To Oberlin? Are you talking about Carlo? No, Oberlin. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, no. Okay, well, that's fair. Yeah. Yep, so Jonas went to Oberlin. Um, and he lives in Pittsburgh now. So, yeah, he's... Uh, yeah. He's an Obi. <laughs> so, you know, I'm just all mixed up up there. 
And then one of my True. dear friends who used to live here, he's from here and used to live here, moved up to Pittsburgh for a while, met her partner up there. They moved out to San Francisco. Now they moved to Georgia. And I think she's living back in San Francisco for a little bit. I don't remember. I, I, I have no idea what's happening. Like I am, a BRB. I am in my office right now. Okay. I am in a like 10 by 10 or nine by nine room or whatever. And I don't even know what's happening in this room right now. And I'm the only one in here. Ooh. That's, that's all I got folks. I got nothing Cookie. else. Well, the rack. Okay. So the racks in, um, cable management is just not great. I got to get some stuff in place. Um, I do have some, I do have some, like some, some cable straps here. Some of the Velcro, sh Velcro straps to kind of clean all of that up. And I got my big old tube of cable ties. Okay. The big old tube of them. Uh, so eventually I will get to clean some of that up because the rack is going to be a permanent fixture. And I like where it is now. Like I can see the Series X there. I've got the HDMI switch box in there, which I may like attach down to the the xbox somehow with like a command strip so i can take it out if i need to um you know stuff like that but yeah uh racks in place everything's good the new router's there um uh where's the so i have the asus rt ax88u um which is Mm, this is my new pretty router, baby. Angry Papa Pug, how are you doing? Welcome on in. Glad to have you. Glad you're here. Um, so Dom, that's the that's what that's the router that I've got. I've also got on top. I've got actually a one U shelf that's flipped over to act as like a top of it because the rack is just the frame itself with the back ba the back um, plates and a couple of plates in the front. Um, before I put in the shelving. So I've got a 1U shelf that's upside down with uh, my fourth monitor on it. So that's actually my like my OBS program monitor so I can see what's actually going out right now. Oh, nice, nice pug, nice. Yeah, just like, let him chill. Just like, okay, no, nobody make any movements. Nobody make any movements. Make sure the kid's asleep. Okay, go. Yeah, my uh, my brother and sister in law are about to go through that themselves because they're about to have a baby here in a few weeks. So, yep, they're about to know that firsthand. Um, but yeah, so then I've got another uh, shelf down here. Um, with the the Xbox Series X, the HDMI switch box Aww. on top of that. Kinder. Um. Then I've got power, um, another shelf down there for like some of the other networking stuff, like the, um, the, uh, like the home automation server and a couple of things for some of the stuff that's plugged in up here, like the surface dock, the other soundboard that doesn't even do anything. So why do I even have it on my desk other than it's really pretty stuff like that? Um, yeah. You're really pretty. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Just like, just okay, like, got okay. him. All right, all right. No, your face is. This is just like, okay, go. Um, a switch, a router, a WAP, and a NAS sitting on a small table under your desk. We'll see. Like this, this used to be two IKEA LAC tables that were st stacked on top of each other. I was like, you know, I need to do this right if I'm going to do this and keep this here. I'll do it right. Plus, the metal rack with it being open air, it allows for better airflow throughout um because like all the shelves that are in it are slotted um so i'm just letting that do its thing um i may rotate the pc case i may slide the pc case up underneath if it'll fit i don't know yet i haven't really decided i haven't gotten that far but at this point everything is in a good place i'm just gonna let it be so 
Yeah. So um I'm gonna I'm gonna need your help here for a minute. Okay. What is the uh, I can't think of the name of it. I just remember the name of it. So I've got a story for you. Okay. Let's go. I just uh I just took Bowser out, right? Okay. And uh we have on our back porch we have that bug, big bug zapper, so we we have amassed a congregation of frogs and lizards in that corner of the patio now. Yep. And um, someone else who has also made their way onto the patio is a uh, a praying mantis. Oh. So he was just chilling out there. Sure, as they do. And uh, waiting for the time I, to strike. I I called Bowser to come back in, and Bowser ran onto the patio and yumed right past him. And as Bowser was running past him, he put his little arms up in the air and was flailing. And <laughs> he was freaking out about the fact that Bowser passed him. And I was like, you tiny little shit. What are you going to do? <laughs> those those things are fucking mean, funny. though. Well, sure. But this one was little. Those things are mean. Yeah, this one wasn't going to do shit, though. Yeah, I, uh, I mean, Bowser's just going to be like, Nyum, fuck you, bye. <laughs> Bowser's a very good boy. He does his best. He does do his best. He does. He does. He's a good boy. <sighs> yeah. So... Let me go back to my email because I wanted to see what y'all thought of something. Uh, let's see. Where is it? Monday. Okay. You have been chosen to participate in the upcoming Halo Infinite multiplayer technical preview this weekend, September 23rd through 26th, and next weekend, September 30th through October 3rd. This email is to confirm your selection and inform you that you will receive all details, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, meow, 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 yada, yada, yada. Okay, so I am thinking, and I gotta, I gotta double check and make sure that it's okay, um, but I don't think there's any NDA on it. Um... Uh, no, because they've had, is this the multiplayer beta or is it a, yeah, this is the multiplayer beta. Yeah. Then it should be fine. Cause they've, they've had, I've seen people streaming the beta already, so it's yeah. And I, 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 th I thought so too. I just, I just got out of the age of empires Four technical betas in like the, they had the stress test last weekend. Um, so, uh, those are still, well, actually I don't think the stress test was under NDA. The beta was, um, but that's something that I'm thinking about potentially doing on stream is playing one night doing, uh, the Halo Infinite beta for anybody who's interested. Um, it would have to be like this Sunday or maybe like the following Friday or something like that. Um, I also have to check with hidden and see, cause I, I think she said this Sunday is not good for her to play. Age of Empires 2, which is what she had picked, and that's what we were scheduled to do, is to play AOE 2 in multiplayer, specifically so she could play with us. Um, for those of us who would play, like Elena, because if there's anybody that I know that's not me that loves them some Age of Empires, it's Elena. Um, she, I think she was the only person who got as excited as I did when we watched the uh the age of empires 4 reveal at e3 so mm. um but she she do enjoy her a strategy game or two uh a strategy game or two your i'll strategy game or two your face i don't know come back to me i'll i'll think of something uh <laughs> so i got to see if that's something that we can do um, that reminds me while I'm thinking about it. 
I want to ping hidden. Yeah, there we go. While I'm while I'm thinking about it. Um, so yeah, uh, I, I gotta see if that's something that we can do. I'm, I'm not great at them, Fritz, uh, but I really, really like doing them. Um, I like, I played a bunch of like original Age of Empires, actually specifically the Rise of Rome expansion for AOE one. Um, I played a bunch of Command and Conquer Red Alert. Uh, which was a really fun game, and we would always play as the Soviets and build a shit ton of Tesla coils just to fry people as they tried to come into our base, which was always fun. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm not the best at them, but I enjoy them. Halo Wars, Halo Wars, I was okay at, not great, but okay. And Halo Wars, I really enjoyed because. The way that they built the radial menus to use on console was really well done. I like the way that they did that for both Halo Wars 1 and 2. Um, so, yeah, I like that a lot. RTS is another, another genre that I am le bad at. Yeah. Yeah, I'm alongside racing games. Racing games. Well, well, well. Uh -huh. <laughs> Any particular racing games that you're not good at? And... Uh, all of them. I mean, I feel like I'm pretty good at Diddy Kong Racing, but I've n never actually tested that uh, theory. So who knows? Uh, listen, like, honestly, though, like. Like Diddy Kong Racing in Mario Kart aren't terribly different. Like... Yeah. They're not terribly different. <sighs> so, yeah, I'm... Th I, I might put... I might put... Uh... I might put... Halo Infinite on the schedule for the Friday after, I guess next Friday, not this Friday, but next Friday. Because let me see, that would be the th first. And that goes from September 30th to October 3rd that weekend. So, I don't know. What do y'all think? Would y'all like to watch some of the Halo Infinite multiplayer stuff? Or is that something that's just... Not necessarily up your alley. I'm crap at Halo, but I enjoy watching people play it. Oh, I'm not good at it yeah. either. Don't get me wrong. I suck at shooters. <laughs> like, Halo Halo is the shooter that reminds me how bad I am at shooters. Um, <laughs> but I still, you know, I still get a kick out of it. I enjoy it. Like, just fucking around. Hmm. Um, years ago, me and my best friend at the time, we were roommates and, uh, we had a rule, uh, we would, so people would come over to the house, um, and drink, especially our friend, Scott, Scott would come over, bring over a bottle of Jack and do his thing. Um, and we would play Halo and we had a rule. The rule was, and this this worked out flawlessly. It was it was like I was so proud of myself because I came up with this rule and it stuck. And I think it's still a good rule to abide by. But if you cannot drive the warthog in Halo, you cannot drive yourself home. Now, here's the trick. No one can drive the warthog drunk. No one can also drive the warthog sober. This is true. So if anyone came over and drank, they just passed out on the couch or the floor, and that was the end of it. So it's a good one. It's listen. It's honestly, I, every once in a while, I, I have a I have a little nugget, you know, 
And that was my nugget for like that decade is if you can't drive the warthog, you can't drive yourself home. <laughs> Wise words to live by. Definitely. I'm going to keep that in my repertoire now. Yeah, you're welcome. But what if you, yours. But what if you can drive the puma? <laughs> Griff, what in Sam hell's a puma? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Simmons, what's the name of that Mexican lizard? Eats all the goats. The uh, the chupacabra, sir. Hey, Griff, chupa thingy. How about that? <laughs> oh. Oh. Griff, are you just making up shit now? Um, <sighs> Lollipop, do you remember the, the Thanksgiving episode that they had? The Thanksgiving special? Where they talked about turduckins? I do not remember this. Oh my god. So they had this whole thing about it. And uh, I think I think Sarge was the one who explained the concept of the turducken. Um, and so they kept getting big and bigger and bigger and bigger. And it's like, we're going to stuff all that into a Boeing 747. <laughs> oh no. It's like, it's like, Simmons, what would you like? First class or coach? <laughs> Oh, uh, that was, that was a good one. I got to see if I can find that. God, 2008. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So did they start doing that with Halo 2? Or was that Halo 1? Uh, I think that was Halo 2. I think that was after they started doing, like, the in-game engine, like, the actual animation engine that they had. My job is to make hey, get out of here, easy. advertisement. Nobody wants you. Yo, advertisements on YouTube. Oh, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> All right, let's see. Red versus blue reconstruction. Wow, that's that's still old. What good therapy watching red versus blue. I mean honestly, <laughs> like, you know, we could do worse. As I'm sure you know, today is a special day. Thanksgiving. Awesome, when do we eat? I thought that since today is an honored tradition. It would be appropriate to recreate the spirit of that original momentous day. Okay, we get it. Less talking, more eating. Unfortunately, it's been almost a thousand years now since the first Thanksgiving, so some of the little details have been lost to history. Yeah, okay. Now can we eat? But using the power of the internet, <laughs> I was able to read a bunch of historical documents on the holiday, which for some reason were all authored by first graders and accompanied by drawings of their favorite Thanksgiving Day food. Severed human hands that have been colored and dressed like <laughs> <in place. laughs> Okay, uh, I'm not hungry anymore. Sarge, people didn't eat hands, they ate turkey. Little kids just drew turkeys by tracing their fingers. Where did they get the hands? Why would they do that? Turkeys look nothing like hands. Because they're kids. I don't know, their teacher probably told them to Stomach do has the rumblies that only hands can satisfy. Hand. <laughs> well, that's just ridiculous. By the way, Why would a teacher tell them that? yes, I do they keep a hand turkey. turkey. No I do keep a hand turkey board. nearby. Where did he get the hands? I bet all their other historical documents are wrong too. You mean your online six-year-old historians might be wrong? Yeah, you might want to fact check. What did they say? I found another historian that says Thanksgiving was the day when all the Pokemons taught the Jedis how to grow crops. That's yeah. also true, yes. Thanksgiving <laughs> sat down at a table and shared a harvest meal together. That's why I took the liberty of inviting our mortal enemies, the Blues, to sit down with us today. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Caboose. <laughs> Excellent plan, Simmons. Invite him to dinner and shoot him in the back. Classic holiday gotcha. Sarge, that's not the spirit of Thanksgiving. Well. Well, you know, not until you. <laughs> <laughs> back. Worst dinner party ever. We all brought dishes from our culture. Sarge, you brought your awful hand. Awful hand oh, thing. Man, I totally love those. <laughs> I love. Individually wrapped snack cakes and cheese dip. 
traditional fare of my people. And That's fair. Prepared a customary Native American meal of maize. Yum. Awesome. What's maize? It's like corn. Yes. But totally inedible. Damn it. <laughs> that means uneatable, right? Yes. Damn it. <laughs> what did you bring, Caboose? I brought my grandmother's famous hair pie. <laughs> <laughs> My grandmother said her hair pie was a huge hit with Oh the my god, I forgot about this. It would be perfect for today. That's not what? <laughs> she was in college, she would give it to all the soldiers returning Oh my the god. War, and they loved it. Caboose's grandmother gets one lewd. The most popular girl in town. She never told me the recipe though. So I had to make some guesstimates. Well, I think we need to have a talk about the culinary arts. Probably some other stuff that you should already know about. Okay, I stop talking. <sighs> Look at them together. That's the true Thanksgiving spirit. I think I'm gonna go lie down and then throw up, which is also another big part of Thanksgiving. Okay, I gotta find. I thought this was the turducken one. I gotta find the turducken one. My favorite thing is watching. Um... Oh God, what's it called? What are their names? They do. They did a YouTube channel and made the turducken. Um, I know the Epic Mealtime guys did it. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah. Yep, they've done that before. They sure fucking have. Do do do. Let's see here. Oh my god. Uh so remember how that was 2008? Oh god, yeah. The Turducken one was not in 2008. It was in 2004. Oh, man. Yep. This is old Red vs. Blue right here. Here we go. I haven't Maybe watched Star Wars Visions yet, no. Website, Red Blue. Looking for information about Red I gotta watch the Bad Blue Batch, too. Yeah, they all want to complain about each other, and they're looking for a new place to do it. Yeah, we don't really keep up with current events, but apparently from what we've been able to figure out, the Red States did something that caused a disaster in the Blue States, and now the people are being forced to evacuate to Canada and France. That sounds pretty for accurate, yeah. Reason, the evacuation is <laughs> led by a fat guy from Michigan. We don't really understand a lot of it. Yeah, and the people in the red states are mad because the people in the blue states are mean to them and want them to pay money for roads and schools instead of cool things like NASCAR and shotguns. <laughs> also, there's something about ketchup in there. Something like about said, ketchup. I, I remember people. that. Holy shit. But our website isn't really about large groups of people that hate themselves. It's more about small groups of people that are able to hate on a much more personal level. Like, I hate Church because he's blue. And I hate Griff because he's not blue. In fact, he's not even really red. It's more like a... Orangey kind of peach. Well, sort of like somebody threw up and decided to call it a color. <laughs> the blue idiot's right. The blue idiot's right. Year, we should all come together and hate as a group, like our ancestors did. And what better to hate than turkeys? And what better way to hate them than to eat them by the millions? Exactly. <laughs> hey, Sarge, how's the big dinner coming? Well, there's seven of us, so I thought one turkey wouldn't cut it. Yeah, I can see how only three pounds of meat would leave us unsatisfied. Are you familiar with the turducken? Yeah, that's what I do when I visit the monkey house at the zoo and make him mad. Not turducking, a turducken. It's a chicken and a duck and a turkey. You know, because the holiday isn't quite gluttonous enough on its own. That's Sounds true. awesome. Is that what we're having? Nope. Although impressive, I decided they stopped short when designing the turducken. Yeah, they seemed like real underachievers there. So I decided to make my own variety. What's that? A polecat stuffed in a possum? Nope. First we start with a hummingbird. <laughs> a what? Put that in a sparrow, stuff them both in a Cornish hen, then put that in a chicken, put all that in a duck, then in a turkey, then in a bigger turkey. Two turkeys? Hey, it's Thanksgiving. Put that in a penguin, stuff that in a peacock, then an eagle, shove it all in an 
an albatross. albatross. Then an emu. <laughs> Next comes an ostrich. Switch. Then a leopard. <laughs> Put all that in a pterodactyl and then stuff it in a Boeing 747. <laughs> cool. I get a wing. I call the turbine. All right. Hunger up, boys. Hey, Griff, what kind of meat do you like? First class or coach? <laughs> you know, if we cook this thing at 350 degrees and 10 minutes a pound, it's not going to be done for 11 years. That's why we're going to deep fry. Oh, oil God. What was that leopard for? Presentation. <laughs> oh no. Oh yeah. Yep. Yep. Presentation. I just Oh fuck man. I'm I'm like that's just fantastic stuff. I miss those days. Those were the good old days. Oh god. <laughs> stuff all that in a Boeing 747. Hey, Griff, what kind of meat do you like? First class or coach? <laughs> it's just the best. Uh, let's see. Did we derail from something? Were we doing anything productive? No, not really. I don't think we were. What do you define as productive? <laughs> That's a good... <laughs> you know, you make an excellent point. You're not wrong. Something, something, she's out of line, which is right. I don't even, I don't even think she's out of line. Hmm. Scarlet, you got to come hang out with us more often. You got to hang out on with us on a night when Allie's here, so that we can, you know, Be so that you confused and not know who's who. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> at that point, at that point, it's it's going to be purely based on the sound of the microphone. Like I know what her microphone sounds like, and I know what yours sounds like, and if, as long as I can differentiate the two, then I'll be fine wild okay. i love it i love it so much oh uh. <sighs> do 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 be do be do. Oh, and I cannot stress this enough. Do be do. Uh, oh my god. I think this is screenshots from an onion article. Signs your landlord is definitely taking advantage of you. Sign one, you have a landlord. Having a landlord is one of the top signs that your landlord is taking advantage of you. Dom, I'm not I'm not getting sucked into breath of the waifu. It's not happening, buddy. I'm I'm resisting that. I will live vicariously through through all of y'all, through like you and Lollipop and Elena and Zundeferon. Like I will, and Allie. Like th that's five. That's 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 enough. See, that's five. <laughs> that's yep, it, There's too many people playing Genshin. I can't do it. I mean, depending on uh, it, there's a very good chance that. It, it's working on borrowed time at the moment. In two months, there there ain't gonna be uh much to much Genshining happening anyway. Why? Why? Why would you say that? Because a critically acclaimed MMORPG from Square Enix will be getting a new expansion. Well, then, see, that's even more of a reason why I can't play it because then I'll be even further behind in fourteen. Like I'm already behind in fourteen. I'm like three expansions behind. I haven't gotten Heavensward yet. I haven't done. Um, um, uh, go ahead, Stormblood. Uh, See, I, I haven't done Shadowbringers. I, I got this. It's okay. I got it. I got it. I can fig. I could do this. I can figure this out. Uh, I I'm like way the fuck away from Shadowbringers. Now, in Walker's mm -hmm. coming out. Like, I don't, I don't have, I, I can't do it. It would be irresponsible of me to pick up another game. I am, I am so excited for next Monday. Just, just for that. Just for me, like actually progressing. Mm hmm. Uh, listen, fingers crossed that I actually make some, you know, more progress. Uh, <clears throat> Also, I've got uh, Metroid Dread comes out in like two weeks. When does that come out? 
I know it's on. I I know I pre-ordered it on Amazon. Where's it at? Let's see, ramen, ramen, Game Pass, Game Pass, EA Play, spatula, light bulbs, air diffuser. Where did that? I swear to God, I pre-ordered this. Not yet shipped. There it is. Yeah. Arriving October 8th. <clears throat> so it's like two weeks from this coming Friday. So I got Metroid Dread coming, which I brought the Switch upstairs. In fact, like the... Here we go. Let me make sure... Yeah, there we go. So, you know. I got I got all the switchy stuff going on now. Let's see what else I got here. Look at all this stuff. So much stuff. Well, that reminds me, I gotta, uh, I think I gotta fix the audio on that now. Oh, I don't have to fix that tonight. I can fix that later. That's not a big deal. You know what? It doesn't matter. It's not a big deal. Just, we'll, uh, we'll fix it in, we'll fix it in post. It's fine. Uh, let's see. Where's the where's the button? There it is. <laughs> so, yeah, I got I got Metroid Dread coming, and I got a feeling I'm gonna play a lot of that. I'm actually like, God, I can't wait for that game to come out. We haven't got a mainline Metroid game since fucking Fusion. Other M doesn't count. We don't talk about Other M. Do, 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 do. I would really like that game, though, wouldn't I? Genshin? Yeah. Um, I, I don't know how you are about the, about the gotcha part of it, but... The rest of it, yeah, I'm sure you would love it. So explain to me how the gotcha mechanic works, because I don't know. I'm I'm dumb. I don't know things. Um so you do some of the characters in the game, you do get them just free for playing it mm -hmm. as just part of the story, doing random things. Um sometimes they're on in, in the shop, but they're for a, a currency that you get in game and stuff like that. So like you do get some free characters, but for the most part, your characters come from uh, doing what they call wish wishing, which is the, which is the gotcha pulling. So you can spend a currency that you either accrue in game at a certain amount, or you can spend real life money to do draws either one or 10 at a time. And those can either be, weapons which is what they are most of the time or you can occasionally get characters that are either four stars or five stars and generally speaking the five stars are better sometimes the four some of the four stars end up being outliers and are really good like it's not a it's not like a um, like a turn-based rpg or anything like that so it's not as impactful in regards to which one's better and which one's not and they're all probably perfectly viable but okay. you end up spending a bunch of money on wishing even though the game's free to play so like you would have you could be free to play on the in the game and get by just fine but you probably wouldn't get to have a lot of the characters that you wanted without a little bit of luck like um like Baidu, for example, the 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 pirate mommy. 
of yes. the game. Yes. She's currently one of the characters that you can pull on. There, there's three banners usually. There is a like a new character banner that has whatever the newest character is, and then three other characters on it with um that have an increased drop rate. You have a banner that is strictly weapons, but have a better like drop chance on certain weapons and stuff like that. And then you have just your general pool of summoning whoever or whatever. And like Baidu right now is one of the three characters that have their um, draw rate increased on the main character banner. So if you want her, now would be the time to draw on that banner. That being said, you don't really... It's still a lot of money. Hmm. Yeah, it sounds like a lot of money. But, I mean, then again... Like, you know me, I'm not going to spend a whole lot of money. Yeah, um... Usually that's fine. I mean, that's why my cheap uh, ass is, plays Game Pass games, because I already got them. Mm-hmm. I'm getting my butt talks kicked. But why? But like why and like don't. Mm-hmm. 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 Like that frankly just sounds like a that sounds like not a great time, I gotta tell you. Like I wouldn't do it. But I mean you know, I'm not necessarily an expert on it. Although I guess, you know, if you're into that sort of thing, who who am I to... Nobody knows. That's half the fun. Who am I to tell you no? do <laughs> Find my, uh, I gotta find my NES controllers for the Switch. I think they're downstairs in the 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 big carrying case, like the the big travel case. By the way, I know we haven't talked about it much today, but can we talk about and can we talk to the very good boy Wedgenold, mm-hmm. Sir Chef Doctor? Is so good, Sir Chef Doctor He's and so Wedgenold is the third MD PhD Esquire, like an actual angel, mm-hmm. like. Look at this, look at this actual angel. An actual angel on earth. Can what we see good... where my angels are? Okay, so how many how many kitties do you have, Scarlet? I have two. Yeah. Uh one is my little uh silver tabby female spirit. And Aww. then the other is my big chunk and black cat Salem. You have a chunky black cat named Salem? Oh. Okay, he has a little bit of white on his chest and his belly, but like, yeah, he's it's fine. Black. It's it counts. It counts. He's like most of the way there. <laughs> he's yeah, the baby. So did oh, you? So so like the obvious question is, did you in fact name him after Salem Saberhagen? I did, in fact. Okay. Okay. <laughs> one of you know one of my one of my favorite lines. One of my favorite Salem lines from the original Sabrina the Teenage Witch run is Salem going, somebody's going to end up crying. <laughs> Probably me. Uh, Salem, okay, so, you know, there are there are characters in TV shows that aren't necessarily, like, the main character. They're a main character, but they're not, like, the primary focus, but they, like... They're the glue that holds the the show together. Like you would feel their absence. Mm-hmm. Salem is one of those characters. Yes. Like the show's about Sabrina, and of course the ants, and Harley, or Harvey. Excuse me. Blech. Um. But. Um. Like Salem is like. He's he's that glue that kind of holds the whole thing together. Um, 
in the Golden Girls, we have Sophia. Because, like, really, the show is mostly about Dorothy, Blanche, and Rose. Mm-hmm. But Sophia is the glue that holds them all together. <gasps> Muggle Mama! Muggle Mama, hello, friendo. I haven't seen you in ages. I miss your face. How are you doing? Rose. Y'all, I, if you don't know the Muggle Mama, she's amazing. She's she's one of them there real good streamers. Um she plays a lot with her her husband and they're just they're just fantastic peoples. Go give them the follows and the love and stuff. They're just the good peoples and I love them. I love your face. I miss you. Um But yeah, so like Salem is like that. I'm trying to think of other shows where like I mean, I guess this one's, I guess this one counts, but like the (sighs) Invader Zim. (laughs) So uh, obviously Lollipop, you know, not, not the main character, but who is the Sophia of that show? I'm going to sing the Doom song. Doom, 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 doom. Mm-hmm. 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 Hi, baby girl. Colonel Potter on MASH. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Um. And and like and like you have to have like you have to have good impactful people to play these roles so like you have you know like Salem we all know Salem like Salem just fantastic um when you talk about like Colonel Potter on MASH you know it, when you have Harry Morgan playing that role like just like just fantastic perfection in a role like just great. God, I wish Tom was here. Tom fucking loves MASH. That's one of his favorite shows ever. Such a good show, though. Ah. Uh, yeah, Colonel Potter on MASH is, is definitely, like, top tier, like, like, glue characters. I guess is the best way. To, there's got to be a better name for that. I don't know. We'll 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 iterate on it. We'll figure it out. Um. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, let's see. What else? I'm trying to think. Who else? In their own weird way, I think. I think Pam kind of is on Archer, like, and I mean, I guess Cheryl too, because I guess Pam and Cheryl are kind of like this like weird unit. Uh, but yeah, I think I think they're they're kind of like that because like obviously Archer's the main character, but it would it wouldn't be the same and like they wouldn't get into so many shenanigans without without Pam and Cheryl plus Cheryl has the ocelot and Archer loves Babu I want you I also want you to know on a related note lollipop the next time I come over to feed the very good boy cheese mm-hmm. I may yell Lana he remembers me don't be alarmed. It's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> <clears throat> also, I also, blew it. also, also, I cannot wait to come back over and just give all the the scritches and pets to the Bowser, who is a very good boy. You gonna get bring the bean over to say hi? It's at some point eventually she would like to come and give pets, but. 
we want to, you know, she's still, she's still going to be closely monitoring her sinus progress. <clears throat> I mean, Fritz, it's, it's, it's true. Like it really is like, you really would have like half the show. Um, oh man. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Season five of Archer was, uh, was that the one where it started with him? Like, yeah, that was vice. Yeah. Yep. That's the one what's where it started. Like, and he didn't remember who he was. Was that, was that season five? Or was that season f four? Oh, that was season four where it started off. Okay. But yeah, like Pam on cocaine, Charlene going up the charts. Um, and I want to say that season five was the one. No, was it? Did he not? Was he in season four also? God, it's been so long since I've watched all of these. That wasn't season six, was it? Oh no, I bet it is. What the hell season was Burt Reynolds in? I thought he was in Vice. Hmm. This is one I did not watch. Oh, that was season three? Jesus. It's been, listen, yeah, yeah, that was season three. Holy shit. Ugh. Like, it's, Archer's been on so long now that it all runs together. Oh my god. Hi, <sighs> Pop. I don't want to work tomorrow. You and me both, bud. I don't want to have to deal with meetings tomorrow. I'm 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 afraid of what kind of things are going to be on my calendar for tomorrow. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about that too much. I do have a um, change control. At three, so that's gonna happen. Mm. <laughs> what else? Um, I'm trying to think what else. Hmm. Not a whole lot else going on right now. No, that's true. Things are pretty quiet. We did kind of get a bunch of stuff done early again. Maybe this time we can just, like, not do so much. I think that sounds like a really good idea. Let's just, like, if someone asks <laughs> if we want to do something, great. let's just not. Yeah, I'm about it. Hmm. I do want to get in back into some more voiceover stuff next week, though. I want to make sure my uh, my back continues to be feeling better and not hurt as much, because that would be great. Yeah, that's also a good idea. Also a good idea. Nathan, I'm gonna hop off. I need to head to bed for now, uh, for work in the morning. Yeah, we're not too far behind you. But Scarlett, thank you so much for hanging out, friendo. I love that you got to spend some time with us tonight. I had a blast. Well, you know you are welcome anytime you would like to join us. So, um. Uh, hopefully we'll get to see you uh, Friday night if you if you get the chance to you know to watch with for the big Mario Kart stuff. But if not, 
I hope you really enjoy your niece's birthday party. That sounds like it should be a really fun time. No, oh, thank you. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, once again, if if you're not if you're not following friend Scarlet, you should be. She's just she's wonderful, and we love her very very much. Um, she is on the Wild server that uh, several friends of ours are on. Um, Mo's on there, Krakow's on there, Scarlet, uh, Luna's on there, uh, a couple other folks. I I forget who all's on there, but <clears throat> that's just. It's a really fantastic group of content creators who are um, doing Minecraft stuff. So if you get the chance to go follow them, check them out, you really, really should. You really, really should. Um, yeah. Um, you know what? I think uh, I think I might call it a few minutes early tonight. Like, we've had... We've had a very big, busy, fun-filled, exciting day today. What do you think? Yeah, all right. Yeah? Is it, should I push the button? Go ahead, push the button. I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, all right. <sighs> Folks... We had a really, really good day today. Um, for those of you who have been sticking with us all day, um, both the morning stream and tonight, push the goddamn button. Um, I appreciate it. I just had just the best time today. Um, uh, if you didn't get to check out the Microsoft event coverage from this morning, go check out the VODs. It's there. Um, a lot of really cool stuff, like all the new Surface devices, you know, we we chatted about it a bunch. I lost my mind at one point. Krakow was there because. Um, so he does what any frog does. What any what any Lorax does. Um, <clears throat> there's so much lore. There's so much. Somebody was like, I feel like I'm missing lore. I'm like, there's so much Krakow lore. It's kind of mm -hmm. ridiculous. There's so much. Um, but. Friday night is the big, big Mario Kart night. I'm so excited. If you, like, I'm... I have so many things to show y'all, to share with y'all that I've been working on for the channel, <clears throat> for our little community. So I'm I'm so, so excited. Um, I really, really hope that you can join us Friday night for Mario Kart night. Um, we're going to start a little earlier than normal. We're going to start at 7 p.m. instead of 7.30. Um, because I've I, I got just all the stuff that I want to share with everybody. So um, very, very, very excited. And uh, I'm hoping that uh, we all have a blast. I think we are going to. Uh, there's 10 of us that are scheduled to be there. Um, <clears throat> me, Bean will be on stream for the first time, at least on voice. Uh, I don't know if we'll have a Bean cam because I think she might end up in the other room. Um, but we'll, we'll figure all that out. Um, of course, Lollipop and Elena will be there. Zendefron will be there. Um, any chuckle fuckery would be incomplete without Alley Pup there. Um, Jonas is coming back. Jonas, the chuckle fuck who, who was a chuckle fuck before they were chuckle fucks. And uh, let's see, who else we got? Matter will be there. Um, Mo, Cracko. Like, we've just got like this whole just ridiculous list of people. Like, it's. It's it's kind of wild. <clears throat> so uh I'm I'm very excited. Um I know she's not going to be sticking around too much longer, but speaking of best friend Mo, I think we should go raid her because we never really get to or we don't get to very often and I love her so so much. Um she's working on designs for their new community server that her and Krako are putting together. Um so very, very excited for the stuff that they're working on. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's go see best friend Mo. Uh, once again, Friday night. Friday night is gonna be the big night. I'm so, so, so excited about all the stuff that, that's, that I'm gonna announce. Um, so I really hope that you'll be here. Um, it's gonna be fantastic. The raid call is in chat. And 
Use it if you want to, you don't have to, you know the drill. Um, and that's about it. You want to do the thing? You love to do the thing. You're so good at it. Yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, smash the notification bell. I did this twice today. You did. You got to do it twice today. Like, look at you. Look at you go. I, I interrupted you earlier just to make sure Allie didn't freaking steal it. That's true. You did. That's, you did. I mean, in your defense, yeah. That. I mean, yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, Y'all be good to each other. Be good to yourselves. I will see you Friday night, 7 p.m. Eastern. 4 p.m. Pacific. Cannot wait. Cannot wait uh, for all the cool stuff that's coming that night. Uh, until then, we will see you later. Y'all take care. So long. <laughs>